Hello there everyone, my name is Luis Wheelhouse and today's date is Thursday the 31st of March 2016 and welcome to another edition of Luis's vlog, Rumble Sexy Titles! Wait, whoa, 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 what is this? What is this? Milk does not go before the tea. That is ridiculous. No, 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 I'm not having that. No way, Jose. I'm making the boiled eggs while my grandma makes the cup of tea and she puts milk in first. Who does that? Who puts the milk in first? Ridiculous. Carry on with the vlog. Unbelievable. Okay, so it's just turned dinner time. I have just finished my eggs. Um, I've got a doctor's appointment at one o'clock, but when I get back, I shall show you how the studio project's getting along. Uh, I've got a bit of editing to do today, but then a bit later on, I've got to put the tuxedo on, and then it's the Golden Hour Awards 2016. Hurrah! So, I'll see you later on. In which, not later on, I'll see you in your belt. Two seconds. Just, just, just. I've got a package and I know exactly what it is, but I can't tell you because it's a top secret project and I'm going to tell you about very soon. <laughs> Shut up, car. Okay, so that parcel was one of many that I've ordered through eBay, but I'm not allowed to tell you what it is because it's a part of a secret project that I'm putting together, a little mini project, which I'm going to be telling you all about pretty soon. Post what you think the parcel is down in the comments below. Hey, hello to the vlog. Hello everyone, uh, just a bit of sad news, that, um, it's just it's just sad, um, we've had another death of another famous actor, uh, this one uh, he is an actor but he's best known for his stand up comedian, his name is Ronnie Corbett and he's died aged 85 this morning, um, he was best known for the two Ronnies but I remember watching him in the room, in the, the, the room, <laughs> I can't say, the, the one Ronnie, <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, I remember watching him in that, and then his most recent work was in the Sarah Jane Adventures in 2009 as the Barney. Um, so yeah, I always remember watching um, Ronnie Carper for me his comic relief sketches. So um, it's sad that he's gone, it really is sad, it's just another legend that's left us. So rest in peace Ronnie Carper. So, Bit of sad news for you there, but what can you do? Ronnie Corbett, not Ronnie Corbett, Lewis. Unbelievable. Okay, everyone. Hello and welcome back to the Studio Project. Um, we last touched this in January, um, I brought it up in a vlog so you know a bit about it but basically we're going to be turning this garage, it used to be um, it used to be a garage when we moved in my dad used it as a studio and they got these walls brought in and it's all soundproofed because it used to do a lot of music so it's a bit of a privilege to take over this garage, um, I, I have been in it before but it's um, my, my, my dad doesn't use it now so I can use it to me on free will uh, but it's been difficult to get stuff into it up until now uh, so we're basically revamping it up everything that was in this room is now at this side of the room you can't see it because it's off camera but it's right there um, so uh, the reason why that was was because we needed to paint these walls so uh, this weekend just gone all these walls have been painted it's a nice lovely I won't say it's a white, it's a lovely cream colour. It's a lovely cream. This is like one of those transformation things on BBC One, isn't it? Yeah. Before, 
Uh, so yeah, anyway, uh, yeah, this is where hopefully pretty soon I'm going to be moving in here as a studio. So fingers crossed it won't be long off now. Um, right, it's going to replace from yellow to white so I can use it on the green screen. Green screen's here, that's going to be still staying. Uh, and that's pretty much it really. Um, I'm going to have my mat down here. I think this table as well, um, this is going to be extended all the way so I can fit my Windows computer on and I can fit my Mac on. So that's how lovely juggly. And there's going to be a new project up there, up upstairs in my bedroom. I'm going to have, uh, this is the um, package that you saw earlier. I'm going to tell you a bit about it now. Um, I'm making a cheap, affordable computer of a Windows 8. And um, it came across an idea that I had a couple of days ago. So I looked into it and I bought some stuff for it. So I'm going to make a YouTube video about that. So uh, more in information on that soon. That's it. So yeah, that's it. this is a garage. And um, you're going to be seeing a lot more of it in future videos. That's it. Um, so before we move on um, through the vlog, I'll show you this quickly. Uh, this poster, this, if any Jaguar fans, this used to be in my dad's old car. About six to seven years ago, he had this camera. There you go. It's lovely, lovely. Right, okay, I've got about three hours now to I need to set off to the Golden Hour Awards. So, um, I'll see you all later in the vlog. Jolly ho! Okay, so this is last year's Golden Hour that I won this time last year. Well, not this time last year, this time last year, tomorrow. Uh, I won this Golden Hour for... Um, the short film The Magic Box, produced and directed by Mark Lewis Wheelhouse, and it's guarded by two piggly tashes. What more can you want, cockers? Woohoo! Okay, so I'm all suited and booted for tonight's Golden Hour Award, so let's go over to the Town Hall. Okay, so we're on the way to Lee's Town Hall for the yes, Golden Hour Awards 2016. It built your bloody back <laughs> so I've got the camera on. Oh. Keep quiet. <laughs> oh, oh. oh, God. No! <laughs> Cybermen! They're not Cybermen. How are they Cybermen? Stormtroopers. <laughs>
it was time for Lewis and his family to attend the award ceremony, where all the nominees were made to feel like superstars. The red carpet was rolled out and a number of high-profile guests attended, such as Elsa from the Disney film Frozen. Once inside, it was then time to wait for the winners to be announced. We went thinking, oh, he might have a chance, because we enjoyed doing the film and it was exciting watching it. Uh, and especially watching it on the big screen, it was fantastic, that. And uh, then when they announced Lewis's name, uh, we really couldn't believe it. You know, I went down onto the stage and it was just really, really exciting. <laughs>